Hi everyone. So as part one, we have mentioned that the rectangular wave sky for WR90 we designed using the PEC for the material for the casing and the design will be like something like this. Okay. So if you don't want to do like simulate in casing, if you don't want to use the PEC as a simulation for the casing of the wave guide, we also can use the boundary condition. So I will show you the example here. This is the design and you can view the length is 22.860 and the width will be the width will be 10.160 so this one is same as the wr90 the wave guide and the dimension of the a and b okay so this design is without the casing and the structure here is the solid is vacuum that means air okay so the boundary condition the set is electric 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 for like enclose it okay as a perfect conductivity okay so from here you can view it the difference is boundary condition is open space because we have the PEC as a casing so it's the wave is still enclosed inside okay so for this case and the result is almost similar so you can view on the S parameter so click on here we can go for like negative 3 dB so you can see it's like near to 6.56 almost similar as the S parameter here okay the negative 3 is almost the same here okay so how we're going to simulate this you can just like I will show you is like create the new template here microwave antenna then wave guide next time domain and dimension is mm gigahertz frequency next so we will set like 5 to 13 and then we click on like next and then the wave guy yeah okay so done so to design this will be similar go to the modeling here click on brick escape so so this one is with that and we have like a here b and c is the not c is l for the length so it will be something like the wave cut is like a and b here and then we click on vacuum for the design so okay so a will be like 22.60 and the b will be like 10.16 and the and the length will be 50 so the dimension we are following the data sheet here 22.86 and 10.16 next so we're going to make it like hollow so we're going to pick face the front here and the backward okay and then we choose like the shape tools here and click on shell solid but before this we can't you can see like it's unable to click so you can go for the component here choose the component and click on cell solid here and then we're going to make it like empty so we double the thickness so we can pick like okay now we have the hollow and we're going to check the dimension so here is 10.16 and here is 22.86 all right so we just create a wave sky port. we can click on the pick here and pick face here pick face here and then simulation click on wave sky port, top one and here the V and the length we choose another with guy pot okay so now we have two pot and then we're going to set our boundary condition to electric and here will be light open okay so done then we try to simulate it just click on setup slower and start Okay, so once done the simulation, then we can click on 1D result here as parameter. You can view the result is as what we want. Okay, so it's almost like 26.56 at negative 3 dB. Alright, so you can do it like using the boundary condition to simulate your waveguide or you can use the PEC design a casing like this. So that's all for how to simulate the rectangular wave guide WR90 using different boundary condition.
Thank you.